Beautiful, don't you think? What? The sunrise. Terrific. So as I said in my review for Captain Phillips, this is the second trailer of the week where I'm like, hmm, interesting concept, but do I want to watch it for like two hours? Uh, I think I said the exact same thing in the Captain Phillips uh, review, actually. But with this film, I think the saving grace here is amazing visuals. I mean, Alfonso Cuaron, this is like, I really liked his Children of Men. Uh, and of course he did a Harry Potter film, but his films usually have a grittier look. This is so slick, but it's beautiful and it really does look very real. So I'm very impressed with that. So that's something that makes me want to see it more than Captain Phillips. When you go see the Captain Phillips trailer, uh, my review for that, I'll give you some more details, but you know, I also said I thought that it was a rental. This, I'm thinking of seeing in theaters, even though I have some reservations because not only the, the graphics, but also Sandra Bullock in this role. This is a very exciting role for her. She doesn't do a lot of action. Of course, she broke in with speed. Uh, she's good at it. I think she's very relatable. A lot of actresses were up for this role. I believe Angelina Jolie was one of them because uh, the studio was like, who are audiences going to want to watch for like two hours, just them and her? And I actually think that Sandra Bullock is a better choice for that. Uh, I still think that's a tough sell. That's a really tough sell. If this, if this movie really is Sandra Bullock floating in space, kind of being like scared that she's going to just die out there, which is of course reasonable, that is really going to be hard to pull off. Uh, as I also talked about, the Cap this is, these are such similar films, uh, with the Captain Phillips review, I also mentioned 127 hours, and I feel that movie didn't work. So that's another thing that scares me about this movie. I just, again, great, interesting concept, but you know, sometimes you think maybe in the development room when someone threw that out there, they should have been like, but is that a movie? Uh, and I've been seeing some people's comments on this trailer that they're like, this looks like one scene of a movie, and I don't know how you're going to expand it to a full movie. But, uh, you know, it looks like at least it's taking some risks. I like having a female lead in the role with Sandra Bullock. Uh, I think she can pull this off. And I, I'm just really impressed with Sandra Bullock's career. I mean, I know she had kind of like a low point for a while, but she's really pulled herself out of that, thanks to the blind side and her Oscar win. But she's kept that momentum going. Uh, you know, Halle Berry hasn't been able to do that, for instance. It's it's just because you win an Oscar doesn't... I mean, you, you, you'll work forever if you win an Oscar, but that doesn't mean you're going to... Everyone's going to see the movies you're making. So, uh, you know, Sandra Bullock's not only doing it, but she's changing it up. I mean, you're talking about someone who this year is going to have the heat and this movie. And that's impressive. Uh, so, what do you think of Gravity? Is this something you think you're going to want to sit through? Uh, and do you have faith in the filmmakers and uh, Sandra Bullock? Oh, I will also say George Clooney. I don't know. He's the one thing that pulls me out of this a little bit. His voice is just so distinct and iconic that uh, I'm always like, oh, it's George Clooney. So that's one of those tabloid things where actors have to be careful. If they spend too much time in the tabloids, it kind of uh, ruins their ability to disappear into a film. But he tries to stay out of the tabloids, so I'll give, him, I'll give him that. So that's my thoughts on Gravity. Write your own thoughts down below. Check out my Captain Phillips review and see if you agree that these movies have some similar similarities and similar problems. And I hope you'll consider checking out some other videos and subscribing. All right, thanks for watching. Bye.